Welcome back to EDU and 90. Morgan here. On this episode, we'll update you on the Google for Education App Hub and new tools for reading on Chromebooks. We expanded our efforts to showcase great apps for teaching and learning with the Google for Education App Hub, where educators and admins alike can discover many apps that connect with Google for Education products, all in one place. On the Google for Education App Hub, you'll find the latest and most useful education app integrations, including classroom add-ons, SIS or MIS integrations, and app licensing. You can visit the App Hub at edu.google.com slash app hub. We're especially proud of our end-to-end -end integration with Adobe Express, a classroom add-on that's also a part of our app licensing program. With Adobe Express, school admins can manage app licenses at scale via Google Admin Console, and students and teachers can access and share their creations all via Google Classroom. What's more, Adobe Express for Education is free to K-12 schools and districts and is available on Chromebooks across the US. Interested admins can learn more and apply in the link below. Now, moving on to reading on Chromebooks. Much of the web's content is inaccessible for those who have difficulty reading. In fact, based on our internal analysis, there are more than 360 billion PDFs that are inaccessible for people who are blind or have low vision and rely on screen readers. Over the last 30 years, there's been a major push for web developers and content creation tools to make their products accessible. But the reality is many PDFs are still inaccessible. So with the help of AI, we're creating built-in Chrome browser features to help fix this issue for everyone. In March, we announced Reading Mode, a tool in the side panel of Chrome browser that makes it easier for students or educators to read text by making it larger, changing the font or size, and removing distractions, is coming to Chrome browser on Chrome OS devices. Now, Reading Mode will also be available for Chrome browser on all computers. And in 2019, we launched Get Image Description so users could get descriptions of unlabeled images on Chrome browser. Today, we're building upon that capability and adding even more functionality to PDFs. We are adding the ability to convert images to text for PDFs in Chrome browser on Chrome OS devices. This means that when a screen reader user comes across a PDF that does not have alt text, which is a description of the image that's embedded and readable by screen readers, the screen reader will be able to convert the entire PDF and image to text and read it aloud. Well, that does it for today's episode, but be sure to subscribe to the Google for Education YouTube channel to stay in the loop for future ones. We'll see you next time. Check out our last episode to hear about Screencast, a new lesson plan from Applied Digital Skills and more.